Hello and welcome to SprueCam Tutorials brought to you by SprueCam America. This is beginning tutorial number 12 and what I'm going to be doing in this tutorial is now that we have flipped the part and set a work offset for the flip side of the part we are going to do an auxiliary program that will um, once the first half of the part is done it will raise up the head of the machine and pause so that you could flip the part so and that will be between 2D contouring 4 and roughing plane we're going to put that auxiliary program in there so we're going to click on 2D contouring 4 just to highlight it and we are going to create an auxiliary operation and there it is the auxiliary operation now we're going to double click on that operation and we're going to put in a motion command so a motion command is controlled by multi go to so we're going to double click multi go to and we have it in the command list now we're going to click plus and we are going to pick Z position and down here in the value of Z position we are going to put 5 for 5 inches so the first thing this will do is now move the head up 5 inches and now we're going to put in an optional stop that's all we have to do is click op stop and it will call out an M1 so it'll go up 5 inches it'll stop there and it'll wait until you click cycle start to begin it again now we're going to click OK and we're going to right click on auxiliary operation we're going to rename it flip part there it is flip part now we will reset the whole string and click run now the auxiliary operations will never have a green check on them they will always just look like a little piece of paper and when you run the simulation let's say we run it from 2d contour you can click on this m1 button up here and it will stop anytime there is an m1 call out so if we fast simulate everything up to this point we'll rotate it to this point and click play Now it has stopped for the M1. We will now click play one more time. And the last operation that we did will start. So the auxiliary operations are very capable operations and if you experiment with them you'll go you're gonna find out they can do a lot of uh, of things to make your life a little easier on the programming side so this has been Spruit Cam 7 beginning tutorial number 12 on how to do an auxiliary operation to flip the part and raise up the head and pause I hope you enjoyed it